Would you believe me if I told you there's a secret side to social media? Beyond the TikTok dances, past the promotional Facebook posts, and hidden between the comments, that's where you'll find your new customer support department. Gabe here. I spend a lot of time talking to folks and answering questions on social media. So here's what you need to know to handle customers who air their grievances on a public platform. Oh, before I go on, if you like this video, be sure to let us know by liking, subscribing, and clicking that little bell. Social pages have replaced 1-800 numbers as the go-to for customer support. And why not? It's way more convenient to hop online and send out a quick tweet than it is to Google a phone number, probably wait on hold, finally get transferred to the right person. You get where I'm going here. In fact, 64% of customers would rather send a message than call a business. But another reason consumers turn to social platforms is because they want their issues heard and resolved quickly. By commenting in a public setting, they're putting the pressure on you. Your other followers are seeing the problem and watching you resolve it in real time. So rather than panic deleting negative comments, here are some tools to tackle customer service issues when they pop up. Find an easy way to monitor social channels all in one place so you're not wasting your time logging into each one individually. You don't have time for that. Answer back as quickly as you can with a sincere apology. If you don't feel like you're in the wrong, you can use phrases like, we're sorry we didn't meet your expectations. Lastly, if you think it could get ugly, don't argue with a customer in the comments. Provide a direct phone number, email, or direct message them privately so you can resolve the issue offline. Remember, treating your social channels as a customer support department won't get in the way of your regular content and creative ideas, but it will build trust and brand awareness. Not only with the customers you help, but potential customers who witness the interaction. But hey, that means you get a chance to look professional and courteous in front of everyone online. Social media is, after all, a place where people go to connect with others. So it's only natural that consumers use it as an outlet for customer service needs. For more tips about online reputation management, click the link below. We'll see you next time.